Hello there. I decided to make a video, like a standalone video for this, because I feel like it'll just be useful to just have it as a standalone video. So basically, I'm going to test uh, my 3080 Ti with K5 Pro, which is like, it's kind of similar to Thermal Paste, but you put it on where the thermal pads are, versus the thermal pads I have on now, which I have. Alright, so this is what I bought. I bought the G Lid Ultimate thermal pads those are the um, dimensions so they're around like 30 bucks together man look at that VRAM bro 100 104 oops yeah sometimes it goes down to 98 96 but still it runs way too hot 102 I thermal uh, thermal pad modded thermal modded thermal pad modded bro English please a thermal pad modded it and it's still like this and whenever I turn on like my OBS or whatever it's just goes down <laughs> it's weird anyway I bought K5 Pro and it should be better than thermal pads and I want to test that right now my AC is off so I'm basically at room temperature and I have no way to measure it so yeah I do have my fan on though, and it's at night, so I'll probably uh, test the temperatures at night also. Actually, what's the weather outside? I don't think about it. Because I'll probably play a good role in this. So it's 53, no, 51 degrees Fahrenheit, or there's no Celsius option. Okay, 51 degrees Fahrenheit. I'll just put it on the screen for what it is in Celsius. And then I'll try it out on the K5 Pro and see if it actually helps or not. All right, so this is the GPU. As you can tell, it's really, really dirty. So I got some alcohol prep pads. And wow, that is very bright. <laughs> and yeah. So. I haven't opened this, I did not want to open this thing up at all, yet here we are. So I'm just going to wipe this off first off, so I'm going to do that quickly. Alright, so I really can't do much cleaning wise with this thing because I don't have an air compressor. So I also got Q-tips to try and get all this in here, and that's the best I can really do. And then I'll just take it apart and put that K5 Pro, which I do not have on this table, which kind of is annoying. It's not the best cleaning job, but better than nothing like there's still gunk in there but I can't reach it with this so yeah now it's time to unpack this baby So, got the K5 Pro right here. And let me focus this. I don't know why, but the, like the, I forgot what they actually call it. The field of view, no. I don't know, the viewpoint is just so small. Uh, it shouldn't be, because the aperture is like four point something, but whatever. So this is what we got to work with. Just this little amount. We got little instruction things, and yeah. There we go. Let me read this up. Yeah, it just basically tells you where to put it. 
and it gives you wrong method and correct method, which the full cover. So you just want to cover all this completely, not just put in the sensor, which is what I'm planning to do. And yeah, cool. Oh boy. Hopefully I don't make too much of a mess from this and have to ever open this thing again. Oh, look at this gooey stuff. Interesting. All right. Man, I wish I could clean this better, but oh well. Let's see, I don't even know where to start. I wanna see how thick this is. Um, let me go through here. So I got these things right here, the thermal pads. Let's see how thick it is. It's like very small. I just want to have something to measure it with. Yeah, okay. Because I want to have it at least a little thicker than the thermal pads. So it could like squish on it really, really good. All right, let's make a mess. Ah. I'm trying to figure out the best way to do this. Like for y'all to see. Throw that there. God damn it, I hate being a lefty. Oh my god, no, I'm just gonna do this. Well, these things are hard to uh, move. Oh boy. <laughs> go yeah I don't have enough to do the back so it looks like it would cost uh, I don't remember how much these things cost but I think it was 20 ish dollars maybe 18 it'll be around 30 to 40 if you want to do the front and the back them now we just do it slowly and s for each of them just to you know spread the force evenly so they don't end up cracking the board or something like that that's why you always do the zigzag when you're unscrewing it or screwing it in oh. that's a mercy tech tips right there
Unfortunately, I did something wrong. 110C, 106C, 110, 100, 110. My hash rate's fucking horrible. Cool. Great. All right. I guess I'll open it up. I don't know what I did wrong, but maybe I didn't put enough of that K5 Pro stuff. I don't fucking know, but I have to fix it somehow. So I put everything up. So uh, audio, light, ding. Oh, that's going to be worse. Sorry. But this is the spot I forgot. This is the only thing that I could see that is messing this up. As you can tell, it all hit the other side, so that's good. And I think I have enough K5 Pro to fill that up with the little I have. So I'm gonna put that up, put everything back together again, and hope it works now. I also want to mention is that whenever I put this together, it looked like my GPU is cream pied. So I can tell you for a fact that I put enough. There's no way that I needed more. And if I did, then Okay, that, that's interesting. I don't, I don't know. The, the only thing I can think of is add more. <laughs> but I don't see that being the issue because my GP literally looked like it was cream pied and I had to clean it up after I put it together. So, yeah. All right, so I'll let it uh, mine again and it's not looking good. I wasted three hours of my time I think there we go I don't know why the scroll reel isn't working yeah look at that 106 C is the max I've seen it at so far 108 fucking hell I'm gonna buy a copper plate I'm about to fucking do it Ugh. it went down cuz I'm recording but I feel like on the thermal pads I was around 70 ish to 80 ish at best so, I don't know what I did wrong. I think I did everything right. Besides that one little mistake of forgetting that one little spot. I mean, I would like for someone to prove me wrong and tell me that maybe I need it thicker or something. But, I don't know. It looks good now because I'm recording and this thing panics and just doesn't mine correctly. <sighs> yep, gonna buy some copper plate. Hold up. Even though the performance should hypothetically be better than the thermal pads I used. I'm going to uh, link the Linus tech tip videos of this K5 Pro stuff. And their results is a lot different than mine. Still don't know what I did wrong. So, yeah. Well, it's pretty unfortunate that I'm doing this. I, I think I do need more thermal paste, so I'm just get that. $65. Say goodbye. Oh, coupon code. Hmm. I don't know any. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Honey doesn't work on here. Ah, uh, oh well. It is what it is, I guess. Oh, there we go. Alright, I want to fill all this stuff out. Well, I ordered it, guys. The reason I zoomed in is just to hide my um, stuff. And for some reason, you don't pay taxes on this. How weird. But yeah, I bought it. So I guess I could uh, do my video idea, but I feel like it's not really worth much because it's not that accurate because the one with the uh, G-Lid thermal pads, it was dirty. So maybe the performance was a little worse and then I cleaned it and all that and changed the uh, um, thermal pads to the K5 Pros. And it's worse and it's still the same thing like room temperature well I can't really say it's the same thing exactly but it's basically the same time I tested it but maybe the uh, temperature outside changed I don't know but it's worse I can't 
I, I'm just surprised it's worse. I, it actually kind of pisses me off. That I, I probably wasted like $100 in total for thermal pads, K5 Pros, those are probably like 40 bucks together, and then this fucking cooling plate for 60 bucks. So yeah, that's like $100 wasted on this fucking thing. So I'm a little pissed. Oh yeah, 69, 61. I, at least they did the funny number. And yeah. Well, I guess I'm gonna do a part two to this uh, thing. And yeah, if you have any other experience, like if you have your own uh, Founders Editions and have your own experiences with thermal pads and stuff, just let me know. Cause I don't know if I'm just stupid and did something wrong or what. Anyway, please just like and subscribe and watch me suffer.